<clears throat> hey folks, this is Wistful Dale here, and welcome to a, another reaction video here. This one isn't MOP horror or whatever, unfortunately, but as you folks may have heard or probably know, um, I freaking love analog horror, you know, I'm a huge fan of analog horror, there's something about it that, I don't know, it just, it just gets me in, I don't know if it's just the uncanny nostalgia of VHS or what, but I just, I just freaking love analog horror stuff, but, um, anyway, um, I definitely want to do more analog horror related content and stuff, and I figured, why not go ahead and take a look at this one here, Meat Product, Life Meat, Analog Horror Short Film by BKRB, or, or Cumbrub, whatever. <laughs> so anyway, um, I'm pretty much just gonna give a reaction here, because it looks interesting, so let's give it a look, why don't we? We could eat meat. A yep, delicacy me. common to many that we've grown to love. Many of your parents' home cooked meals typically have meat in some capacity. Yeah, like a much. savory, tender cut of steak for dinner with green peas and mashed potatoes on the side oh, and cooked yeah. to perfection. Or a juicy, Don't delicious the steak hamburger sauce. at the summer barbecue. It's certainly hard to beat. But there is a problem. Some we can't enjoy burger. meat forever. Recent studies have found that, if not tackled soon, the world's meat supply chain will fail within the next 20 to 30 years. Oh no. Gonna have the meat. Just go to Arby's. So after all the world's meat is gone, what then? Surely there must be something we can do in order to continue our love of meat. Well, we here at Universal Food Solutions Incorporated have developed that solution to tackle the impending loss of all the world's meat. Oh, Introducing really Life Meat. Meat made with no meat. After what? years of research, development, and testing, we have created a solution that will allow us to continue savoring the sensation of meat long after it's all gone. Depending on... All right, see, so we got turkey. We got Kong Tonga raided. Well, whatever. We got turkey, chicken, red beef. I don't know why it doesn't. Why does it say red beef and not just beef? Ham and pork. Okay. But where's the seafood stuff? I'm sorry, I'm not a huge seafood guy, but where's the salmon? Where's the halibut? Crab? Clam shells. Well, I guess those won't will be meat, but there's still meat in a sense, right? I mean, yeah, they're not land, but there's still meat, right? Seafood? You gotta have crab. I'm... I... As much as I'm not a fan of seafood stuff, I don't mind taking crab away, but... Come on. You gotta give it to the seafood lovers too. What you're looking for? Life meat comes in a variety of forms for you to choose from. Canned or sealed, life meat. Con. Condesist. Condesd. Condesd. Whatever. Alright, um. That looks actually better than the plant based shit. It provides everything. Alright. Pork. You need to continue enjoying meat. How can you put that in there? <laughs> I'm sorry if we keep stopping, but how can you put that? What, what are you? Ham. How can you stuff ham in that? <laughs> what? As you already have. Chicken. Turkey. Unlike conventional meat, which is highly inefficient and is limited in supply, life meat can not I only suppose. be produced much more quickly and in higher quantities, it's also healthier. Really? Oh. Yeah, too much meat, I guess. Hey, 
COVID-19 and all related products have been recalled by the U.S. Food and Drug Administration due to an outbreak of an unknown pathogen. The consumption of live meat may cause abnormal behaviors, occurrences, and deformities. Dispose deformities. of all live meat what products immediately. For your hey, what was that back there? It was like a frame. break of an unknown pathogen. The consumption of live meat may cause abnormal behaviors, occurrences, and deformities. There it is. There we go. Pause. What the heck is this? Looks like we've got folks in hazmat suits. What are they taking over? You know, I bet you it's a cannibal or something. Has Dispose to. Dispose of all live meat products immediately. For your own safety, as well as the safety of others, please avoid live meat products. Oh, dude, death meat. It just tastes better. In fact, life meat is so good and widely approved that NASA will be supplying astronauts with life meat as part of the first manned mission to colonize oh, Mars. Really? So why not try life meat today? We guarantee a better, healthier, tastier, and no compromise alternative to conventional meat. Life meat. Available now at supermarkets everywhere. Yeah, I think it's a cannibal or something. Like, they just get humans or whatever and stuff, us ourselves, and they, I don't know, like they make all muscles into whatever mixture, chemical, whatever, and then bam, select whatever, da da da, chicken, turkey, red beef. I don't know what's with red beef. There was something back there too. Back here. Due to pathogen occurrences, dispose of all. There was like a newspaper. Yeah, there it is. No, go back. Like, death me plague. Death me plagues U.S. Um. Widespread, right, right, spread panic, deadly fake meat. <laughs> yeah, I'm telling you. Oh, there's another thing too. Go for no, damn it. There we go. Um, company behind life meat, a product that is once considered the. Potential cure to world hunger is now under investigation. I'm assuming, um, and questioning by the U.S. standards. The, after its product started, a uh, 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 reports have been made. Da, da, da. Yeah, <laughs> I'm telling you. Yeah, man, that was pretty, that was pretty decent, I liked this one, um, it's definitely, um, it reminds me of one of the plant-based stuff, which I, know I kind of mock on, but I'm just not a huge fan of plant-based meat, you know, I don't like freaking, I don't like impossible meat, I never tried it, but it, it just doesn't seem right to me, you know, I don't know. Maybe I will try in the future, whatever, but yeah, this one just seems similar to freaking plant-based meat stuff, but at least it's not, like, killing widespread, like, with these ones, but yeah, um, plant-based meat, honestly, to me, it's just disgusting, it's like, it's the bottom of the bottom, you know, it's, it's process on top of process, so... But that's just my view and my opinion overall. So, anyway, overall, this was just a simple reaction video of uh, meat product life meat. <laughs> if you folks enjoyed this, be sure to uh, leave a like. Uh, the link for this will definitely be in the description below. So, that's uh, pretty much it for this video here, folks. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Be sure to uh, leave a like, leave a comment, and subscribe for more. And I'll see you all sooner or later. Bye-bye, everybody.